What up, Melvin7 here. Marquee matchups are out and we've got a wide range to be fair. Uh, the first one we've got is Kashima FC, sorry, Kashima versus FC Tokyo. And uh, you need 11 Japanese players. I believe this is the first Japanese league uh, marquee matchups that we've ever had. And uh, yeah, it's fairly simplistic. You need one Tokyo or Kashima player. And uh, I believe. Well, one of these certainly is. I mean, obviously, I'm not really an expert in this league, so I don't know. But there, the cam is from uh, Tokyo. And uh, the rest of them, you just need six different clubs. Very, very easy. You can use bronze players. So I've just used the lowest rated that I had in my club. Submit that. 95 minimum chemistry. So that gives a little bit of leeway in positions. If you don't have some of the positions, like the fullbacks, they might be expensive. Anyway, next one, Sevilla versus Real Betis. 11... Oh, well, actually, this is the only one that isn't league-specific, but it's still easier just doing it in La Liga. Uh, if these La Liga players are too expensive, maybe try La Liga Santander 1... Sorry, Liga 1, 2, 3, basically the second Spanish division. But you need eight clubs maximum, which is fairly easy. Six Spanish players, one Betis player and one Sevilla player. 90 chemistry, so again, you can have a little bit of leeway. And uh, yeah, I've just basically gone for some of the untradeables in my club, some of the lower rated players. I've made sure I've got six Spanish players. Very, very simplistic there. Uh, the severe player I've got is the goalkeeper. And um, I've actually got two Betis players. So you know what? I'm going to swap one of them out because they'll, they'll go for a little bit of an enhanced price, I would imagine. So we'll put uh, put some other random in here. Uh, I mean, Anika Williams doesn't really go for anything anyway, but uh, there we go. That's a 15k pack for that one. Now we've got Galatasaray versus Besiktas. You need 11 Super League players, four rares, one from Besiktas, one from Galatasaray. All have to be gold. Very, very simplistic again. So we've got the Galatasaray player Inan here and um, the Fenerbahce. No, it's not Fenerbahce. It's Besiktas, which is the centre back here. I don't know why I've got him in cam, but I still got 100 cam anyway. Marcelo and the rest of them you just have to pretty much make sure you've got four rares and then the rest of them have to be gold in the Super League and then the last one we've got is the EFL Cup Final Man United versus Southampton again very easy you need three rare players four English players um, team has to be exactly gold so it's easier just going with the Premier League one Manchester United player one Southampton player so I've got Forster there and I've got Young and the rest of them just low rated Premier League players very very simple marquee matchups not too bad in terms of the rewards either um, especially for the value overall you also get a thousand and another 25k pack there for completing that so overall that that's a better marquee matchups than last week I think where we got basically fuck all um, right, so the first one is the old players pack, which tends to be the worst. The rare player, I think, was silver there, if I am right. No, it was bronze. Terrific. Right. Um, ha. The League 1 high-rated players won't go for anything now because Deli Ali is expired, but people may not have realised that, so we'll list him for 8k. See what, uh, if he sells, do we get anything else? We get another League 1 player, maybe he can sell for a little bit. Nope. Uh, Alright, anyway, we'll store that into the club, store everything else to the transfer list, move on to the next pack. Right, what do we got here? We got 324, well, that's really good to be fair, that is, uh, that's almost 100k worth of packs for ridiculously cheap. We get a high rated flare there, is that Gaitan? Gaitan, that's not bad. 85 rated. Uh, I will definitely take that, no upgrade, no downgrade for Gaitan, but uh, a, a definite card that will increase if um, the inform uh, packs are released like the SBCs you know what I mean anyway 25k pack let's see what we can get in this it's not a big flare there so it's gonna be 83 or lower um, it's Salah he unfortunately doesn't go for anything even though he is an upgrade um, I believe I sold him for like 1.4 yesterday, so I think that uh, CDM is also an upgrade, but of course they're not really that desirable. Next pack, no walkout, special flare, new. So that's 83 Alua again. A little bit of a disappointment. Um, I think this guy is an upgrade, plea. Um, I don't think anyone else is though, so store those all to the trade pile and open the last 25k pack. Come on. It's not a walkout, please be decent flat. It's not. Alright. Gaitan is a lot better than what I've got in recent marquee matchups as it is. Um, so, yeah, I mean, 
I've been a little unlucky, not the Gaitan, but the 25k packs, and I suppose you would get, well, you'd at least get your money back with those kind of packs, like 90k value of packs for probably, I'd have guessed, 30k, like it can't be more than 40, uh, tops for all four, so anyway, hopefully you have enjoyed, subscribe if you haven't already, like the video, and yeah, peace.